Welcome to the ITDVDs.com YouTube channel. This is just a sample of the training available at ITDVDs.com. If you would like to see complete training, please go to ITDVDs.com. Now let's begin the sample. Okay, I'm on the server. We're going to be installing Exchange 2010 on, and we need to download and install the Microsoft Office 2010 filter packs. To do that, I'm just going to open up Internet Explorer. I'm going to go to Microsoft's website, and I'll go ahead and paste the URL into Notepad here so that you can see what it is. It's going to be Microsoft.com slash download slash en slash details dot ASPX and then family and you can see the rest of it. And as of the making of this video, uh, it might not pop up in Google right away. It's pretty new. You might get a beta version, but know that there is a real version out there. And I'm going to scroll down and I want the 64-bit version because we're installing it on Windows Server 2008 R2, which is 64-bit. So I'll go ahead and click Download. Click Save. And I'll just go ahead and save it to my desktop. And let's go to our desktop. And I'll double-click on it to run it. Click Run. And click Next. Accept the terms, click Next. Okay, and the installation completed. And uh, this filter pack basically just contains Office iFilters, which allow Exchange to search and index through Office files. And then finally, since we're installing the client access server role, or we're going to be installing it, we need to go to our services snap-in. And we'll just scroll down a bit. And we want to change the net.tcp port sharing service to automatic. By default, it's going to be manual. So I'll just right click on it, go to properties, and set it to automatic. And click OK.